to the enemy's camp And I took that white soul for me And I took that white soul And I took that
touch on that one. The reason Joyance hasn't been going to Cape Town is because the most viable venue for Joyance is the Grand West Casino. However, if you check Joyance 12 DVD and you scrutinize it, you'll see that the venue was not packed up to capacity. And if you if you're somebody that travels a lot, you will know that I'm a flight from Joburg to Cape Town. I attend by a little bit hefty and longer. So cost, logistically and financially, you know, it doesn't make sense. So we've got to retain joyous to come in the Eastern Cape. Now, I don't know if I'm going to tell you how to do it, but it's
Look, I'm a preacher. Not everyone that is in this place has a personal relationship with the Lord. Amen. It's not to sing songs of Zion, Amen. but you don't have a personal relationship uh -huh. with Jesus. You can sing the songs, you can dance to the songs. The worst thing that can infringe and confine you is a spirit of religion. Yeah. Jesus died on the cross so that you might have a relationship with him. Ah. If you are here and you're looking at these people and you say, I go to church, I love gospel music, but I don't remember giving my life to Jesus. If, if we do all these things, it costs money to bring us there. If we do all of those, but we don't give you an opportunity to accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior, we will fail. Now, I want every eye closed. Play, my brother. Every eye closed. The reason I'm asking you to close your eyes is because when you close your eyes, your eyes are the window to your soul. You don't get to see anybody else, but you see your inner self. And if you are here and you are a child of God, I want you to eternally pray in the spirit and wage war for that soul that needs to be saved. If you are here and you've never received Jesus as your Lord and Savior, this is your night. This is your morning. It's the morning. I want to pray with you. Please, I beg you. If that is you and you say, Sylvester, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. I want you to lift your hand. Lift your right hand. We want to pray with you. Lift it up. Lift it up. Don't be ashamed. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. I'm waiting for the brothers who want to give their lives to the Lord. You can live without God. But don't choose to die without Him. The Bible says that it is appointed unto men to die once and after that to face the judgment. But I don't want you to receive Christ because you're fearing judgment. I want you to receive it because He loves you. I want you to lift your hand. I want you to respond to His love. If that is you, I want you to lift your hand. Hands are going up. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. That is the first group that I want to pray for. Drop your hands. Whilst every eye is closed, whilst every eye is closed, if you are in our midst, you say, I once received it, but I have gone back to my old ways. I've backslided. But tonight, I want, this morning, I want to recommit my life to Jesus. If that is you, and, and you're saying, I want to come back home, lift up your hand. We want to thank you, my brother. Thank you, my brother. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. Thank you. That's the second group. Drop your hands. The third group I want to pray for, which is the last group. If you are here and you've never received the baptism of the Holy Spirit ah. and with the evidence of speaking in other tongues, which is what will fuel you in your walk with God. If that is you and you say, Sylvester, I've been longing for that. I want a fresh dose of the Holy Spirit. I want the fire of God to purge me. I want to be refilled with the fire of the Holy Spirit. And I want to speak in new tongues. If that is you, lift up your hand. We want to pray with you. We want to pray with you. Yes, I see those hands. Thank you. Drop your hands. Now, that first group that received Christ for the first time, I want you to make a bold step, which some of us once made. I'm going to ask you, I'm going to implore you, I beg of you, I exhort you, I want you to come to the phone, I want to pray with you. Come, my sister, if you raise up your hand in the first outer call, where you want you receive Christ, come, please. Those people, come. 
I saw the sister's hand up there. Come. You were the first group that lifted up. Don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed. There were a couple of hands that came and that lifted. Don't be ashamed. Come. Come. That first group.